what it do. So the weekend right now is doing numbers right now. The weekend just broke Genesis World Records of the most popular artists. Like Abel is famous right now. The goddamn Canadian singer who performed at the goddamn Super Bowl. Big Abel is goddamn officially to go. At least according to the folks of the Genesis World Records who data show is officially the most popular artist on the planet. This guy's guys don't do no interviews. He do no media run, no PR. The guys just drop music and it's silent. Though it's kind of remind me of like a Maxwell, he just drop music and disappears. Like he don't do no type of promo. I haven't heard the weekend talk. Like man, him and Frank Ocean don't talk. And where's Frank Ocean now? They gotta put an APB out on Frank Ocean, man. Uh, weekend just broke two new records on Spotify. One of the most monthly listeners in Spotify history, reaching a hundred and eleven million mark, and another for being the first to breach a hundred million monthly listeners mark in general. So he just running up the bag, like. This man is sack chasing. I mean, Big Bank take Lil Bank. He out here doing numbers. He's out here just just climbing the charts. It shows you that he don't even gotta do ah, gotta do interviews. This is how big this guy is popular. Is without saying the word, his music is speaking for himself. He's letting his he's letting his songs do it. The man started from the bottom, writing for Drake for Take Care, and now, man, he's taking care of his family, getting to it, really running up the numbers right now. Abel, I mean, I didn't ever thought this guy would be this popular right here. Uh, yeah, it, it, it's like this man is in the class of his own right now. Like he's on a total another level right here. The weekend, man, upper echelon, barely do features. Uh, th this guy's up there, man. He's up there with the Kendricks, the Drakes. Uh, the J Kendrick Drake, J Cole, the weekend is on that type tier level. Um, even I say he's on Beyonce and J level because he doesn't tell people when he's dropping a project. He just drops it. He just drops music and disappears. It's it's amazing. Like he's a ghost. He's power with all that. He's like ghost with all that power. Like this is, I don't know, man. This man is like one of the most best to do it right here. So, but yes, yeah, this generation, he's definitely probably the most popular. Um, and it's hard to say, man, who's better though, the weekend or Chris Brown? Who y'all who y'all debating right now? Put in the comment who y'all think better, the weekend or Chris Brown. Like I'm probably gonna go Chris Breezy. I can't get mad as goddamn people say the weekend. No able, man. This, this, this guy's really doing his thing though. But I still feel like Michael Jackson and Michael Jordan are one of the most famous people on the planet. Like everybody across the globe know who those people is. But yeah, man, he's doing numbers though, man. Earn it, man. That, that 50 Shades of Grey soundtrack he produced, he made like just amazing, man. Just timely music. Make timeless music. Classical music. Classic music. So yeah, man, he wanted to, he's, a, he's a definitely a big step in the game though, Abel, man. Just a silent assassin at that too. But y'all like, comment, subscribe to the video. Do y'all agree or disagree? Who y'all think better, Chris Brown or The Weeknd? That's the debate right there in the comments. Y'all leave it. I'm out of here.